No, I'm good. I'm good. Thanks. Ryan right. from Italy. Looks like a good cup of tea. Oh, yeah, right? A little, little taste of Italy right here. Thank you. Hi. So you got to play Cowboys, Cops, and Ghostbusters solo in one movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty playful and fun to Yeah. I, I retired. I'm retired now. <laughs> yeah, we did everything we could do in one movie. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was pretty great. I love fantasy stuff. I love that world and, and the afterlife and exploring that through these characters was great. Yeah. And uh, Jeff, you said before you like the bizarre and surprising in films. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's obviously for both of you. Like, um, yeah, can you elaborate on that a little bit? Yeah, I I, uh, I love going to movies myself, and uh, I'm one of those guys who. Uh, don't like to read, you know, I don't like to read uh, reviews or watch trailers of movies that I'm really interested in seeing because I want to be surprised. And this movie is a real surprise. I remember reading the script and I couldn't believe what I was reading. I would have to turn back and say, wait, wait that, what happened here? You know, yeah. And so this is full of surprises and the premise itself is very absurd, which I like. And uh, uh, what about doing movies out of comic, I mean, graphic novels or comic books? It's something that Ryan has done before and you haven't yeah. done this much. Uh, well, I did, uh, you know, Iron Man was kind of a thing. I don't know if Tron wasn't a comic book. It felt like one. But I think, you know, these days, uh, a lot of the uh, guys who are making movies and financing them are looking to uh, graphic novels uh, because uh, it's almost like looking at a storyboard, you know, shot by shot. It really gives them an idea of what the movie could be like. So I think we'll probably be seeing more and more of that. One of my favorite movies was Sin City. Did you dig yeah, that? Yeah, that's oh, cool. Yeah, I wonderful. That. Yeah. Frank Miller. Yeah. yeah. And there was a mix of action and comedy. Uh, how did you balance, you know, the two? And there's, there's a lot of genres all thrown in one, as, as we said, and there's mm -hmm. action and comedy, and you, it looks like you enjoyed doing both. Well, the process was great. Mm -hmm. It was a great set to be on. We hit it off right off the bat. Yeah. I mean, it was so, so nice working with this guy. It just was, it was an honor as well. So, I, I, I mean, you can't ask for anything more than that. A great environment to, to create and work and play. And, yeah. And, and they're kind of similar. I mean, I, I approach you know, comedy and drama basically the same way, you know going to make it real. The, ta the task, I think, is to uh, kind of find the tone of the movie and kind of work with that, you know, you know, you know yeah. the earnest quotient, you know, how, yeah. you know, how seriously you're, yeah. you know, all of that kind of, of stuff. Course. But basically, the approach, from my point of view, is basically the same. So going back to the supernatural, I mean, there's a long tradition of trying to imagine the afterlife. Did you guys ever imagine what it's going to be like? <laughs> We didn't, uh, I don't know, I, don't, I didn't do too much of that for some reason. I have absolutely no idea. Yeah. Yeah. I have no take on it either. I, have I no guess it's like, as, I was just thinking it's like uh, how I was telling you about uh, movies, you know, I don't want to know the trailer, I don't no. want to know a review, you no, know, I want to yeah. be surprised. Yeah, you, know? <laughs> yeah, you may be surprised. <laughs> Who knows <laughs> what you come back as. Yeah. Yeah. And in this case it was surprising the avatars that you were, I mean, uh, Ryan is a Chinese guy and you're a... Uh, Lady. Yeah, gorgeous. You're gorgeous yeah, lady. Yeah. yeah. So, Argo, what would you choose if you could choose? As an avatar or something to be in the next life? Mm. Wow. Mm. What no. would I be, huh? I was thinking so maybe like a, uh, you know, an unliving object, like maybe a chair. Yeah, all you're going to see is your asses yeah, in your yeah, face yeah, all day, yeah. though. I don't know. You really no, my face would be up here. That's you know. so funny that you but, yeah, or something, just want to say huh? a chair. Are you, are you were? So, yeah, I was going to say a chair would be terrible because oh, it would just be oh, yeah. just the entire world sitting on your face. Yeah. That sounds awful. Here comes another one, just like yeah. ass and then yeah. blackness. And then, yeah, you know, right, yeah. terrible, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah.